Nah! Unzips PP. Okay, Chris, you need to you need to be locked up ASAP. Now it gets really bad when you realize that Mr. Beast was also in the server sending messages. Mr. Beast and Chris Tyson Discord leaks. Mr. Beast allegedly complimenting Chris Tyson. He does look like a girl in that picture on the right side. With minors. They did a good job. Not gonna lie. He isn't big enough. I know, Mr. Beast. This is the actual Mr. Beast. No, I know his PP size and it's huge. Dude, this is a horrible Whoa. experience. How do you live like this? Well, I don't know, Linus. I don't have time to research. You know it's what? Thing. Can't you just build me one? Shut up, with this whole situation going on with him and this, this one of his employees or his friends. Check this out, man. New Mr. Beast allegations have just dropped, and it's not looking good for Jimmy. So last time we talked about Dog Pack 404's viral video, where a former Mr. Beast employee exposes Jimmy for allegedly conducting illegal lotteries towards children, promoting gambling, faking his videos, forging signatures, manipulating who wins the prizes and monies in hey. game shows, and mostly giving it to his friends and employees. At the end of the day, bro. At the end of the day, well, I don't know, because if he's saying it ain't read, then it shouldn't be read. But if he came out and said, like, okay, I don't read, this is true random people, then, yeah, that's kind of messed up. You know what I'm saying? You taking people's shot away from them. But, um... Employees rather than random viewers. I don't know. Much more. Now, I don't know. I mentioned in my last video that Mr. Beast was actually caught in the same Discord server where Chris Tyson was openly. This is one of his best friends. I think this is one of his best friends, bro. So, you know what I'm saying? It's all about who you hang around with. You dig bad influences, get you in messy situations. My mama always told me if you ain't ready to go, like, if you watch out who you who you who you who you hang out with, because bad influence can can wrap you in a lot of situations. Peer pressure, the art of peer pressure. Shout out to Kendra Lamar. The art of peer pressure is very different. So, you know what I'm saying? It's definitely very powerful. I don't know. He's a grown man, so he's not. He shouldn't be getting peer pressure by his friends as a grown man. You feel me? So, hey, I don't know, but it's a sticky situation, baby. It's a very sticky situation to be in sharing prawn to minors and yeah, that's, now we have allegedly he information that it was indeed the real jimmy and it is seemingly provable by searching the archives and seeing that his account is linked to the mr beast gaming channel dang cuz possible unless you own the channel and can log in meaning essentially mr beast lied in his response saying that he just became aware of chris's actions in the past few days listen when in reality he made a mistake when he did it could you make yourself look guilty man you make yourself look guilty if you lie. You feel me? Don't, you know what I'm saying? Just be honest. Just be honest. Just be like, oh, well, I I knew he was kind of like doing something weird, but I ain't know for sure. I didn't know for a fact. But now that I know this for a fact, I'm going to remove myself away from the situation. You feel me? That's just my opinion. You know what I'm saying? You move your way from, move, move your, you know what I'm saying? You did. <laughs> Y'all get what I'm saying? That's wild! ...for over a decade and defended him until the recent drama. Now, it actually gets worse for Mr. Beast and Chris because 500,000 messages Woo! have been released to the public from that Discord server. No! This is after Chris and his squad wiped out every message that they thought was incriminating, but there's still so many left. Moreover, Lava, Dang, one of the victims who was groomed by Chris, now recognizes that it was inappropriate and wrong what was happening in the server. So let's go over these messages and explore this insane hey. rabbit hole. Here we have a tweet by Drama. You know what? That's a power move. People who trail on kids, that's like a power thing. You feel me? Like, because what can a, in, in rea reality, what can a child do for you? In reality, you feel me? Like, in our reality, if you're a grown adult, a child can't help, help you in no type of way. You feel me? So... There's a power thing, man. You got to be sick in the head for situations like this. Just being real, dog. Things, Chris Tyson I'm just being real. Discord with minors. She's only 14. Damn. Okay, so these messages are from 2018. So you know what, though? Post an attachment. I tell you what it is. They be wanting, like, virgins. They be wanting pure women. And I understand, but that's more when you're around that age. You feel me? When you're about 15, 14, maybe 16, you might slip up or mess up. That's more understandable than... You damn 30 years old, cuz. 
Come on now. Because when you when you that young, I don't care what nobody say. When you that young, you go to school together, it's like, you know what I'm saying? You don't see it as wrong. You It's illegal, but at the same time, y'all in school together, you feel like, but, you know, it's still very wrong. Don't get me twisted, but you have no reason to be associated with a 14-year-old, man. You're a grown man, bro. But, hey, let me stop yapping. I mean, Chris replies saying she's only 14. Damn. And this is allegedly uh, uh, BB, which I'm not going to say her name. Otherwise, uh, my last video got age-restricted and demonetized completely oh! when I said her name. So, not age uh, what did you think she was? 16 and legal in some states. Oof, of course. If she's 14, I'm 14. Oh, so my God. Links to the famed lollipop. No. Shadman. And Chris. No, he didn't just say if she's 15, I'm 15. Take him to jail. Put him under. Put him under the jail. Just linked the website. Put him under the jail. Also referred to as Lollipop God is back. An NSFW channel. It's hot as hell in here, cool. Hold up. Give me a second. Issue. It's hot as hell in here. Let me open this door. Let me turn the air on. It's like I'm in a sauna or something. You know what I'm saying? With the channel, what I have an issue with are minors that have access to said channel. Chris says, is there even a way to do that? Not really, no. So what do we do, lol? Remove it? No, people like it. Even if there was a way, anyone can lie about their age. Yeah, true. And I mean, to be fair, the internet is full of prawn. Discord says if you not child porn, way, bro. Have one, oh, it's I'm sorry. I didn't mean to say that. Not child prawn. From viewing prawn My bad. materials. Chris responds saying, what am I, a parent? Lol. Uh, I say we get rid of this because the fan base of Mr. Beast and Chris are mostly under 18. And Chris obviously completely ignored this and continued going with his absolute degenerate tendencies with minors. Oh Chris my says, God. No than peeing in the shower facts, waterproof phone gang, and added an attachment of presumably his image. Uh, we only worship Jeebus around here. Challenge accepted. The God. Oh yeah, daddy. Daddy Chris. That's a lot of moisturizer. Why are you in the shower? I don't know if this was a picture of Chris or something with minimal clothing, but I'm. This is bad. This is bad. Hey. Chris Tyson role playing. No, it is not. Hey. Nuzzles your necky wecky. Fight me. Love you guys. Nuzzles. Woo! I think he messed up, cuz. I think he don't messed up, dog. I think he done dropped the ball on the goal line. You know, I think you don't. You fumbled the bag, brother. It seems like we just talked about this with um, Dr. Disrespect. Like, why you get so much money, so much power, you work so hard to get in this position and you fumble it? Like, how? For people like myself and even more more, more creators out there, other creators like Casanet, Queso, the people that really want this so bad would never, I highly doubt they would ever fumble the bag like this. Like, why? Do you not know how good you got it, bro? For us people, they got to work 40, 50 hours a week, 10 hour shifts. Out of touch, bro. Out of the Peepy. loop. And people, kids are fans of these people that are weird, bro. You're not fans of what's real. Y'all fans of what's weird, and it's crazy to me. Just being real. Nah. Nah. Unzips PP. Okay, Chris, you need to you need to be locked up ASAP. Now it gets really bad when you realize that Mr. Beast was also in the server sending messages. Mr. Beast and Chris Tyson Discord leaks. Mr. Beast allegedly complimenting Chris Tyson. He does look like a girl in that picture on the right side. With minors. They did a good job. Not, not his gonna PP lie. isn't big enough. I know, Mr. Beast. This is the actual Mr. Beast. No, I know his PP size and it's huge. Dude, this is a horrible Whoa. experience. How do you live like this? Well, I don't know why is it. I don't have time to research. You know it's what? Thing. Can't you just build me one? Beast, are you gay? The moment you okay? I'll deep throat Chris PP. Haha, <laughs> Mr. Beast joins in to comment on my PP size. I love it, and that's Chris. Vindication, Jake Franklin, Jake the Viking also oh my God. Saying Jimmy knew, and then he says, I called it because these uh texts have been revealed. Why y'all weird? Confirmed that it is actually Mr. Beast. It has been linked to his official account, as I mentioned. Oh lord, it's going to be a long night. Okay, so I gotta mention a couple additional things that are happening. They got lawyers on the China though. Chris Tyson is being accused of SA by someone. I was SA by Ava Chris Tyson. Moon Skeena has come out uh, with their story here. I'm not gonna go into it. You, you know what? And read it if you, want. you know what's crazy? A lot of, a lot of Check this out. 
I don't know if I'm wrong or not, but I think the same thing happened with Chris Jenner. With or Caitlyn Jenner, whatever you want to call her. To where you do something so wrong, you try to change your sex, your sex to kind of override the bad publicity you're getting to be good publicity. Are you doing the same thing? Are you doing the same thing? I'm just saying, you got caught doing something weird, but now you're trying. I don't know. Maybe I'm wrong. Maybe I got the timelines misconstrued, but that's all. I just wanted to say that. I just want to put that out there. I just want to put that out there. Stuff going on. Never mind. Don't, he, don't, he don't look like a girl. Or, as a fetish. I don't know. She doesn't look like a girl. Whatever you want to be yes, called. I used the correct pronoun. Told me that he got fully aroused. When he secretly stole my female clothes and put them on, he's deliberately Wait a minute. disturbed and it's 100% a fetish. He's narcissistic and professionals have told him he needs a full... So he got hard when he dressed up as a girl? Absolutely groundbreaking if he was mocking the LGBT community by, you know, pretending to be trans or something like that. But I can't confirm any of this. These are allegations from other people, right? So I'm just reporting on it. And before anyone says anything, yes, it is confirmed that is Chris's sister. Former Mr. Beast employee Jake the Viking says, after seeing all of this i'm glad that they fired me <laughs> i think nobody wants to be involved this. with mr beast anymore i know that's right have a really hard time oh cool anymore now oh, we're cool. Move on to the mr beast game situation oh cuz mr beast is doing an amazon show called beast games and it's essentially one of his videos but on a very wide scale right and tons of people are coming out with so many allegations that the environment was incredibly unsafe with uh, allegedly people being denied medication, being beaten by other contestants, given very little food, some allegations that girls were tackled and assaulted by guys on the show with zero repercussions. Mr. Beast is a monster. Mr. Beast's alleged contestant speaks out. You know what? Unfair teams. And with all that being said, he makes a great candy bar. I'm just being real. And if you look deep enough in any company, Disney, that owns most of everything, the NFL, the NBA, they're ran by monsters. Let's not get it twisted. Your favorite show is probably written and ran by a network that's full of monsters. So let's not act like it's brand new just because it's Mr. Beast and he's a YouTuber. Everybody that has a lot of power, the guy who made Tesla, I forget his name, Elon Musk, is it Elon Musk or no? I don't know. I don't know if it is him or not, but he's probably a monster. Just saying. People, when they get a certain amount of power, they become monsters. Because people are monsters. You know what I'm saying? We, we as people are naturally monsters. So never praise somebody and think that they're better than they what they are. You know what I'm saying? Thinking they're perfect. Because with this being told, man, in honesty, though I mentioned some people earlier, I'm pretty sure they're monsters as well. I'm just saying, money does some wild things to people, man. And contestants being depressed after Mr. Beast just wants to psychologically disturb people. Hey, she also made. I think it's almost bound for once you get to a certain stature in anything music, television, YouTube, you know, that you'll crumble. You'll get so big that you have to implode. You know what I'm saying? And, that, and now it's his turn. And I just pray and hope that I never become so famous on here that I'll be like this because everybody's a monster and everybody has skeletons in their closet. Hopefully, you don't have skeletons like the PDFs of the world, but um, everybody's done some shy things. But this year seems like everybody's getting exposed and... Ah! Two videos about this here is the terrifying, one. bro. I'm to keep you guys updated on what I've been hearing about Mr. Beast Beast Games. Since I posted my video yesterday, I've pretty much been talking with more people involved with the show all day. At this point, I've lost track, but I think it's nearing like 100 people who have reached out to me with their stories. Each person has their own experience and their own opinions, but overall, the stories that I'm hearing just break my heart. I have never heard of anything like this on any set. So today, I want to read a statement from another contestant. Strength. I
insane scandal. We were given maybe 400 calories a meal and one, only fed Holy every crap. 12 hours. Food would run out and people would fight, steal, and hoard food. What kind of sick game was this? I thought this was yeah, like this, regular Mr. This like squeaky games, eh? Fighting over food and water? Oh, uh, no. Water was scarce and kept running out as well. I had to sit with a bloody pad for two days before I get undergarments and my reusable pads because I'm allergic to regular pads. We we're also sleep deprived only allowed to sleep three to four hours we all slept on the floor on the stadium in a ten dollar sleeping bag they offered anyone who lost one thousand dollars to sign away their rights to join any kind of class action lawsuit of oh anybody. lord that is an insane thing to even offer that's hollywood girl welcome to hollywood everybody want me to star. welcome to hollywood everybody getting back doored in the first place isn't that implying that you've already done something really wrong yeah i didn't sign so i did not get the money after the article came out and things started blowing up they called everyone back and decided to offer an additional thousand dollar per person to make up for the inconveniences and we'll get to the article as well because that is yet another bombshell they knew it was bad because they also offered to provide therapy sessions using their own insurance and it wasn't amazon prime that called me it was the mr beast crew so this therapy session would coincide with what that woman was saying about how she wanted to neck herself. I mean, uh, initially, I did think it was a bit far-fetched because it's a game show. But if what they're saying is true and you were beaten and starved, I mean, yeah, you would want to neck yourself and you'd need therapy sessions, right? I mean, this would be in proof. They hey. don't have to sign an NDA. So this is what gives the most... Non-disclosure agreement! You could! In the article, it mentions that, yeah, the nurses are confirming these stories as well because they were getting a sudden influx of injured people and it was all coming from the Mr. Beast challenge, dude. And I think the reason this happened is because Mr. Beast is used to dealing with 100, 200 people at a time, maybe. And he went straight to 5,000 or something, like way more than he can handle. And, you know, he didn't yeah. have the staff. He didn't have the yeah. team to handle all of this. And this absolutely blew up in his face. Here we got yet another contestant with another story. I was expecting for this competition to be hard, but I did not expect to endure what I did. It was a shit show to say the least. I believe they were in over their heads and did not plan very well. Here are some of the things I experienced. No one was using a microphone to make announcements, so it was very hard to hear what production was saying. A lot of things got Jesus. missed. I had to hear through the grapevine about certain things like when they had Gatorade, when we could go to medical, and when they had snack bags. This just seems like a really poorly organized event that led to an absolute disaster, you know? You know what? Undergarment this bags, is what I think. I think he tried to do something really big and he wasn't quite... Like he says, they weren't, he wasn't quite ready. He don't have as much power as he think he does. You know what I'm saying? Stick to the 50, 50 people tops. I would stick to 50 people's tops because that's as many people as you got the, um, the, um, the manpower for, or the resources for. Let me, okay, there we go. That's a better word. So keep it small, man. Everybody makes mistakes, but with, his homeboy, you gotta get rid of that, cuz you can't stand behind it. He weird. By last name, I did not receive my Unless you wrapped up in it too, then you weird filming. too, boy. After the first competition, they hadn't fed us in a while, and I was feeling lightheaded. I asked someone if they had anything to eat, and they told me to push through and basically suck it up. Oh, you want food, peasant? No, 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 not, not here in the Mr. Beast. This is, this is a dojo, all right? You don't get food, pal. On the first day, after 12 hours of having contacts in my eyes, I asked someone if I could go to medical to take them out, and they told me no. I witnessed two people that had seizures. And it took medical several minutes for them to get there. I'm assuming this happened because they did not have access to medication, but I could be completely wrong. Medics should have been on the field 24-7, ready to go at all times. I is too many people, people though, bro. At your event, Mr. Beast. What the heck? I heard people were being pushed and shoved by males. I received an email yesterday checking the, how they're going to check footage. When unprepared for the scale, making decisions as they go along, the bare bones medic staff and that's on top of the the, the situation that's going on with his night. homie. They compete at night. Let me know what you guys think about all of these Mr. Beast. Hey, I appreciate you more, Pegasus. I almost subscribe to you. Anybody who liked that content, it ain't my own. It's more Pegasus. I'm just reacting to it. It's crazy, cause. But my 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 um my um advice to Mr. Beast, get rid of your homie. Unless you was doing weird stuff, then you're cooked. Because this is the year of everybody getting exposed. And I'm sorry for you if you do get exposed, man. I hope they don't pull your candy bars. They're beautiful.
They taste amazing. But if you're weird, you're weird, buddy. If you're weird, you're weird. And you're going to cook in jail. Just saying. Just saying. But what, what happened with the people in this competition, that, that can happen to anybody. You just want to understand. But let me know what y'all think, man. Definitely subscribe to the channel. Hit that noti bell if you like content like this. And until next time, I'll see y'all when I see y'all. Peace.